So is the matter resolved? Good. No. As I said, I am not partial to crowded areas. This... Yeah! It's a super impressive looking giant deer! Let's go take a look together! <sighs> Sky Bracer. <laughs> a Ming Xiao Lantern nonetheless. A fleeting creation of human hand. It means nothing to me. If this short-lived spectacle is one you wish to witness, I suggest you go to the city. Oh, I really won't go. Unless, let's go find the boss. She might have a few tricks up her sleeve. Sounds like you and Xiao took care of business again. <laughs> Word certainly got around. The news even reached us here. Ah, <sighs> and yet another year's lantern right will soon be over. And he still won't go and take a look. <sighs> All these long years and I've never seen him attend the lantern right. I'd go as far as to say it'd be easier bringing the festival to him than the other way around. Bring the festival to him? Yeah, if Xiao won't go to the lantern, right? Uh, sorry, surely you realize I was joking. How would you bring the... When we were in the city checking out the festivities, we learned how to make Xiao lanterns. We even found a food stall serving local delicates. So much tasty food, so many pretty Xiao lanterns. Not to mention, um, what else? Oh, the bygone heroes, his old friends. Aren't those the heart and soul of the lantern right? You're not wrong, but where would we settle that? Now that you mention it, I won't... Hey, let's take a look and choose a space. Hmm, there should be a... close to the elevator entrance. I think we can do better. Now, here we'd be constantly interrupted by the foot traffic. After peak season, not being so. Some Not too bad. And it's safely away from all the foot traffic. Ah, oh, we've got ourselves a nice spot. If you'll excuse me for a moment, I'll... And voila! A little rough around the edges, but it should serve us well. What do you think? Oh, There's no big deal. Just a little bit of DIY that I picked up years ago. <laughs> well, we can check the stall off our to-do list. It looks quite festive decorated with that shell lantern, wouldn't you say? Well, yes, but in my generation, it's just the norm for everyone who grew up in Liyue. Anyway, speaking of festivities, no celebration is complete without a feast. Almond tofu, that's for sure. We've made it for... Almond tofu and grilled tigerfish. Oh, what an interesting combination of flavors. I'll have a word with Smiley Yan Xiao. He should be able to rustle those up in no time. Luckily, the inn's pantry contains all the necessary ingredients. Oh, it's about time to summon our honored guest. Nothing was... Now, we've 
had the talk about crowded places. What is that supposed to mean? You brought the festival to me? Okay, so there's a bunch of delicious snacks just laid out below the inn, and a bunch of Xiao lanterns, and there's practically no one else around to have to worry about. Better hurry up, or the food's gonna go cold. Come on down! What you meant by bringing the festival to me? <sighs> Is there no end to the peculiarities of human behavior? Does it serve any grander purpose? Is that so? <laughs> Less fathoming, more eating! Come on, dig in before it gets cold! Concentrate on eating now. <sighs> now that we're done with the most important part of the celebration, we should be heading out to see the Ming Shaolin. 